Technology is the force which takes something that is scarce and makes it abundant. So Bitcoin is the internet of money and blockchain is the internet of value. Productivity, new products and services, this is the history of technology. So I think that this year it's all about what's just about to happen and next year is going to be what the hell just happened. The goal with Exponential Finance is to help people understand the impact of exponentially accelerating technologies on the financial services industry. So I think part of what we're really trying to do is help people imagine what the world could look like. If you look out what's where we'll be in say 10 to 15 years from now, we will be very easily able to provide a very high quality standard of living for all biological humans. By the year 2035, GDP, because of robotics and automation, states will be $12 trillion more than it would have been without robotics and automation. It is our job as investors to figure out where that $12 trillion is. So in terms of solutions, there is a way to set a much longer term path. There is a way to create an ethical and responsible cryptocurrency, whether using Bitcoin or another blockchain like Ethereum. I'll teach you how to do that a little bit later. Blockchain tech is going to impact so many different industries, and we're going to see the benefits from everything from financial inclusion to water to environment uh, to healthcare. And that's what got me so passionate about this technology. It wasn't how it worked, but the impact it was going to have. And as we dematerialize things, as things go from hardware to bits, and the marginal cost of those replicating those bits is near zero, and the marginal cost of transmitting those bits is near zero, we end up in a very interesting world. This really is a critical moment in history. I actually believe that the technology, robotics, and AI are going to actually take away most of the work that we, have, we do today. It's basically very tightly specified, highly standardized routine tasks. Uh, that's what work is for most companies and most people. Uh, that's not what human beings should be doing. So in light of all this exponential change, the question is, what should your reaction be? You know, our next century is just so deeply about creativity. Imagination, emotional intelligence, social intelligence, all of that has huge value creation opportunity. And that's where we humans should be focused. This is the year that everyone is kind of pegged for quantum computing really to tip. Mindset that's best to take is to say, what would I do if I had an almost infinite amount of computing power? Right, so here's a future where that is abundant, that helps lift all boats. And exponential finance, and frankly, the focus of Singularity University, is probably the only place we've seen with that over the horizon look around what technology will do to an industry. So this is what I love about Singularity, besides the fact every time I come here it blows my mind, I learn something new. But they, they ground us, and Peter Diamandis has always been very deliberate about we need to do something that betters the world. And oftentimes we're 100% focused on the bottom line, helping our clients be successful, which is important. But you could do that and make a difference. I mean, just to have so many great minds in the same place at the same time is, is such an incredible opportunity. A great space to swap ideas, see what's happening in the industry, uh, and learn about what you know, the, the exponential future of technologies like blockchain is going to be. And that's it. Exven 2017 is a wrap.